FirstNet is going to open a whole lot of uh, doors that we have not had an opportunity to walk through from a technological standpoint in the fire service. It's going to give us an opportunity to do things and be connected to people in, in circumstances we would have never been. We had about six missing children this morning, just this morning alone, and within minutes they were found. We're able to text a picture to responding uh, ALS units and they're able to find children within minutes. Quality of service goes into how data on the network is prioritized. FirstNet users have a higher prioritization throughout the network. So your data, whether that's text messaging, video, or any application, that all turns into data and it goes onto the network. And that network is combined with all the other network data. But your data is actually has a higher priority than all the rest of the network data. If you think of from a highway, your data is going in the fast lane compared to all the other traffic going on the network. When I need to be heard, the right person can hear me. When the right people that I need to hear talk, I can listen to them and be clear. The data I need is at my fingertips where I need it and when I need it. And the data I don't is not getting in the way and distracting me from my operational job. So to me, that invisibility of communications, that support function and structure, when that's working and when that's trusted and when that's always there, then we have the right quality of service for public safety. Quality of service, where we're doing this in the lab, is we're actually demonstrating packet prioritization. So we'll actually do a speed test and show that public safety's packets and throughput of their data is actually uh, going at a higher rate or has a higher priority over the commercial traffic. In our lab, we have complete control of the RF, we have complete control of the number of users on the cell, and we have the exact same models of phones with the exact same apps and the exact same software. So we can control everything down and then we make a comparison of throughput with one user over the other. In a controlled environment, you can see that, hey, these packets are prioritized over this with the same amount of resources. 